Hi, my name is Brian Mount, and I'm here today to talk to you about the exciting world of cymbal playing. When I was in grade school, I started on piano, and then I played bassoon, and then I played clarinet. All the while, um, I was driving my family crazy by tapping on everything I could possibly tap on. So uh, I started playing percussion in eighth grade, and everybody said, right, okay that makes sense for him. There's a lot of different ways to play percussion instruments. We strike them with mallets or sticks. We shake them, we hit them sometimes. Um, and with uh, cymbals, we uh, you know hit the two cymbals together, but I think you all know that. The reason why I chose cymbals is honestly because they're my favorite instrument. I just love playing cymbals. There's such a great variety of different kinds of cymbals. I generally prefer very dark, heavy cymbals, um, but there's, there's so many choices and each piece has one cymbal that's just perfect for this one spot. The thing that I probably like the most is when the orchestra builds up to this crazy emotional moment and there's really nothing more that can be added except this big monster cymbal crash. That's just, it's, those moments are, are just, are extremely special to me. So now here I have an even bigger pair of cymbals. I have a 22 inch pair of cymbals. There you can see them. Um, and these are quite heavy and we don't actually use them very often because they're for really big moments in, in music and uh, I've used these many times when playing Mahler symphonies, and they're great for that, that moment uh, when the orchestra's just building and building, and then there's one last thing you could put in there, and it's a big old cymbal crash. So I'll play one of those for you right now. You can see the cymbal just waving from the impact still. I just want to thank you so much for uh, coming to the orchestra's website and learning about our different instruments. Um, and I really hope that I will see you sometime out in our, in our beautiful orchestra hall. Thank you so much.